Wow. I can't believe that they would say that, man. And they're in Canada. You know, you make America look like a bunch of jackasses, first of all, right? And no matter if you're pro-Trump or not, if you're all about Biden, the left, it doesn't matter, man. They tried to assassinate a president, bro. And you're out here in Canada making America look like a bunch of freaking clowns, for real. Meanwhile, this guy tried to take out a former president that's running for president. Jack Black, Kyle, I love Tenacious D, man. I almost seen them live. I was close to seeing them live last year at that crappy Blue Ridge Rock Festival. <laughs> if you know, you know. But I, I can't get down with them no more, man. You know, and I'm not like this crazy Trump guy. I'm just covering content that's what's, that is relevant and what I feel my audience wants me to cover. This is a, a historic moment and it's crazy. And this is some trashy shit you did. You both are punks for it. And I know Kyle was the one who said it. But Jack, Jack clearly was not um, phased by what he said. You know what I mean? He could have been like, ah, we're just kidding and just joking and this, that, and the third. You know? Even my kids love Jack Black, right? Back in the days, we used to see him on Yo Gabba Gabba, like, and I, I just, you know, I'm just so disappointed, man. I'm disappointed. As a fan, I can't F with them no more. And I'm not on that ca cancel culture-ish, but you know, the cancel culture shit is something really that the lefties do. I'm not a lefty. I'm not a righty. I vote for who I think is going to get the job better. That's gang mentality. When you just vote for the left, when you just vote for the right, you might as well just say you're part of a gang. You know, you might as well create some sort of rag to put in your back pocket. Because if you're voting for the person just because you're part of that, that side, that's gang mentality. You don't even realize you're part of a gang. It, this is so foul. I want to know your opinions, but I'm just speechless about it. I heard about it. I said, there's no way. There's no way Jack Black would say that, man. You know, Jack Black's a funny dude. And I do appreciate some dark comedy. But nah, not this. Not when someone dies like this, man. And I'm not talking about the one that tried to take out Trump. I'm talking about the innocent bystander that caught that stray. Real, real trash, man. Real trash. And you know, I actually spent some time with Jack Black two days on set. For a school of rocks back in the days in New York, in Staten Island, man. And he was so cool, man. I've seen him, you know, backstage with Pantera recently. Like, dude, I'm just, I'm just so disappointed in Homeboy right there, man. You know? I'm disgusted. Let me know what you think. I really want to know what you think. Hit the like. It lets me know to continue covering this type of stuff that's going on. I'm just, I'm speechless. Damn, Jack. Kyle. Damn. Watch the video I did not too long ago. It should be right there, too. It's an interesting story about this woman that some people were actually blaming and saying that she was a part of this whole thing. And I debunked the whole thing. She did not have to do with this, man, in my opinion. Okay. Um, and people are out here just like saying that she had something to do with it. I see it all over social media. I debunked the whole thing. As I said, I'm not here to push any kind of conspiracies. I hate politics with a passion, to be honest with you. But there's so much that I see that's crazy, and I want to speak about it. And this is my outlet right here, The Dell Show. If you're new here, subscribe. If you love the show, join the membership. But yeah, I told you before, but we weren't done talking yet. Check out the video talking about that woman. I debunked the whole thing. I feel bad for her because she... Probably is getting all kinds of harassment um, through maybe social media and in real life. And I don't think she deserves it. I may be wrong. Later on, they, they may prove something. But I think I debunked it like to the point where it's unbelievable. And I, f I actually feel bad for that woman. Uh, but yeah, man, um, at this point, f*** Tenacious D, man. Y'all really are foul, man. You ain't got to like Trump, but that's fucked up, bro. I'm out.